We're about to spend the next five days aboard the Disney Dream for a very merry time Christmas cruise. This is our first cruise ever, so to say we're a little excited is an understatement. All right, guys, we are about to get on the ship. Holy moly, guacamole. Who's excited, guys? Oh, me. All right, here we go. We're walking on the ship right now, guys. Oh my God. All right, there's no turning back now. Alright, you guys. Alright, that's what I call an entrance right there. Nick, what do you think about that? We should I should take it in actually, because I haven't even looked around. I'm like in shock. What's up? What's up? There is oh, wow. so cool. As soon as we got on the ship, we could not wait to go into the pool and go down all the water slides. Oh yeah, got it right out there. We're super excited for a week out here at sea. Oh. Getting ready to go down the Bahamas. And all that fun Some stuff, blue water. So. Are you ready? Oh, I am so ready. All right. Ready? Let's have a good time. <laughs> so this is the first time the kids are gonna see our room here on the ship. They haven't seen it before and it's a balcony room. Are you guys excited? Yes. All right, go ahead. All right, let's get in there, guys. Whoa, oh my God. What? Oh, it's so much Christmas. Look at the balcony, guys. We got cheese. We got cheese. Oh, we got some shampoo. Let's go check out the balcony real quick. Oh my god! Jeez! Holy moly! What are you guys Don't say? Don't your phone! <laughs> what do you guys say? Oh, I love it. Alright, so we got there's five of us, so there's a drop down Murphy bed. This turns into a bunk bed. We have an awesome comfy bed. And this is going to be our home for the next five days. We headed up to the main deck for the sail away party, which is when the ship leaves the port. What's going on here, Sandy? Oh my gosh, it's quite the show! Oh, we're leaving, guys! We're leaving! We bolted up the stairs to get a better view and say goodbye to land. What? All right, here we go. Bahamas, here we go. Cheers, man. Cheers, baby. Cheers. 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 So, uh, check out the ship, guys. Wow. How amazing is this? As okay. the sun set and we departed, the dream became more alive. Oh, bye, guys. Everybody's waving at us over there. How cool is that? We hightailed it back to the room to get cleaned up for dinner, but we did not realize that all the people who live in the neighborhoods down below honked their horns and flashed their flashlights to wish you a good trip at sea. You ready to go to the Bahamas? Yeah! Let's go! It's time for the tree lighting ceremony, and if we're lucky, we might even get to see Santa. Seeing smiles on the kiddos' faces is what the holidays are all about for us. These are the memories that we will one day look back on and get emotional and say to ourselves, remember that one time we went on that Disney cruise for the holidays? And just like that, the tree is lit for the holidays, and Santa and Mrs. Claus arrived on the ship. One thing that blew us away was the dining experience. Hey, do I have it? Is that normal? They specialize in something called rotational dining, which means that you get the same wait staff for the four nights, and they rotate restaurants with you. Oh my gosh. They really become like part of the family because they know your names, all the food and drinks that you like and don't like. It was pretty awesome. There is no better way to finish out the night than the all-you-can-eat ice cream bar. We were having a competition, and I think Ryder was up to 14 by this time. All right, here we are, day two. Let's go out here and check this out. I think I see NASA over there in the distance. Is that the Atlantis? We decided to stay aboard the ship and check out all of the amenities it had to offer. One of the coolest things was the different kids clubs that this ship offers. There are three different clubs. One was for the younger kids called Oceaneers Club, which is for kids up to 10. Then there was Edge, which is for kiddos from 11 to 14. And the last club is called Vibe, which is for 14 plus. Once the kids got the lay of the ship, they couldn't wait to go to their clubs, which is really cool for parents because we got some time to reconnect and just have fun together. The kids had such an amazing time in their clubs. They even became great friends with their counselors and were entertained literally from sun up until late into the night. While the kids were living their best life, it was time for us to get something to eat again and watch all of the people go on their adventures in Nassau. 
Mickey and Minnie made a surprise appearance, then we ate again, and Nixon got the best braid job we have ever seen. We didn't even realize that we're moving, and so we're like, let's get to the front of the ship and uh, get some footage and whatever. All right, that's it, we're on our way out. Bye, NASA. Castaway Key, here we come. I'll never be this young, I'll never be this young again. After a beautiful sunset, it was time to check out our first show on the ship. We had no idea what we were in for. Now you're not allowed to film in the show, so you're gonna have to see it yourself, but it was amazing. We just saw the show Believe, and what do you think, Nick? It was amazing. It was amazing. I felt like I was on Broadway. Kudos to everybody here, all those performers and dancers, they were absolutely amazing. After the show, we headed up to the upper deck to see the holiday party. We even got to see snowfall on a ship in the middle of the Caribbean. We are going to the Royal Palace. Then it was off to another epic dinner with an even more epic entrance into the restaurant. Wow. So that was an entrance. Woo! Thank you. Guys, what's up? What's up? What's up? We're here. All right, we are here in Castaway Key. We finally got off the ship, and now we get to go have a whole bunch of fun today okay. on a private island that Disney owns. How cool okay. is that, guys? Where's really cool. So one of the cool things to do here is do the photo ops along the way because, you know, you're only going to be here every so often, so you might as well grab the photo and the professional photos. And, oh my gosh, Captain Jack Sparrow's right here. Holy moly, guys. Yes, Holy moly. Jack Sparrow's in the house. All right, Sky, what's going on here? We are going to all the places. Also, how do you like my bucket hat? <laughs> pretty cool. Okay, so here at Flippers and Floats, we get to rent a bike, a snorkel set, and a floaty. So that's what I'm most excited about right now. I want to get on that water. All right, it's time to go in the water, do some snorkeling. We're going to try to get out here to see Mickey's statue. <laughs> And the word is all the buoys have something underneath them. So let's go down here and see what's down here. This was the perfect place to go snorkeling. The water wasn't too deep, so you could easily dive down to the attraction. And there was something new to see about every hundred feet. There is something really special for us when we're in the water. It seems like all the distractions float away and your senses are on full alert and nothing else matters but being in the moment with your family. All right, I know tropical is our vibe for sure. And we've been away from tropical for a minute. It's been but a minute. But once we get out there, what's up guys? What? <laughs> but once we get back out in this tropical vibe, man, uh, this is where we're supposed to be at for our sure. Our souls are happy. We, this is definitely, yeah, cheers to that. Oh, cheers, cheers. Man, cheers. Got a little margaritas here, some doubles, some double uble margaritas. So when you're on the boat, there's more than enough things to eat. But here we are on a tropical island. And this is Cookies 2 right here. They have a Cookies 1 and a bunch of other places that you can eat here. But uh, yeah, you just roll up at lunchtime, grab whatever you want, buffet style. All right, Nixie, what yeah. you going for? You got a lot of stuff over here? Yeah, this is what I got so far. So we have a Disney dessert hack. Grab two cookies from the buffet line, throw some ice cream in the middle, and make a cookie sandwich. All right, ready? An ice cream cookie sandwich. All right, throw this one on top, and then, oh! Uh, Give me a big bite. <laughs> mm. How is it? Oh, it's so good. Something that we absolutely love to do is explore the island. And what better way to do it than on a bicycle? Now the kids are in the teen club and they're kind of doing their own thing, playing with all the kids. So we are going to do some adulting time, which what? We feel I very like that a doing, lot. But I <laughs> Come like on, it. I was, let's, so get, let's get on one We're going to jump bikes. on some bikes and go have some fun. Go on an adventure. This is a date? This is date day? All right, Sandy, let's see how good your uh, oh, bicycle yeah. riding you know skills are here. We have doing that triathlon in Bali on Gilly T. Oh, we did, but these bikes are way nicer. Uh, this way nicer. <laughs> and my pedal fell off and all that. It was really fun. <laughs> this is way nicer. And I'm loving the color of my bike. So we're headed out to Serenity Bay right now, which is an, an adult only uh, beach, which I'm really excited about. But we're on a landing strip a landing right now. Strip. How crazy is that? We just stumbled on this lookout tower here on Castaway Key that we're gonna go check out because I'm sure the views are spectacular. Let's go. Any alligators? Nope. All right, so we got to the top of the lookout point here. Oh, so oh man, I just love this island vibe. Look where we came from. I don't know if you can see way back over there, but the ship's back over there. 
and that's how far we've come so far. The thing that we absolutely love about this travel lifestyle is the friends that our kids meet along the way. Now Sky here, actually all the kids met Haley on the first day, and Haley is, how many cruise ships have you been on? 15. 15. This is our first. So, the awesome thing is Haley showed the kids all around the cruise ship on the first day. Now, we still were lost trying to get to our room, but the kids knew everything. And so, that is a huge perk about this travel lifestyle, is otherwise we would have probably never met Haley and how awesome she is and her family. And we get to do these things and they'll be friends forever. So, huge bonus to travel life. This island is so big that if you brought your running shoes, there is a 5K that you can run and get a medal when you're done. I'm still bummed that I forgot my sneakers. So I guess we'll have to go back again and I can get that medal. Right here, I see the beautiful oh, blue water. I see a glimpse of it and it's looking up. Hey, you know what? We're going in right now. Get it off, girl. Go, go, go. Throw it on the ground and go. Come on. <laughs> All right, I think I'm gonna get a hold of the captain of the ship and see if we can uh, maybe stay here another night because uh, <laughs> I don't think we can got we a, a I don't think bit? we got enough time here in the adult only section of uh, the beach. More pristine, more blue, more white powdered sand, and uh, more epicness. Just... All right, what'd you find? All right, so this is probably one of those things. When you get a hammock on the beach, <laughs> you, you just gotta it. figure out how to get in it. <laughs> All right, we're gonna attempt the unattemptable. I'm gonna try to get in this thing All right. with Sandy without flipping it over. <laughs> <laughs> I need some more weight on this side. Yeah, let's go over that way. There right. we go. Oh, it's <sighs> time for a margarita and a nap. <sighs> now I know what Jimmy Buffett was talking about. Oh, is this the blue that you were thinking about? Oh blue, yeah. Huh? <laughs> this is the blue of the this blue. This is the blue I was talking about. Sandy, the boat's leaving. We got to get back quick. <laughs> we always are the last ones to leave. For some reason, we're the last one. One of the last ones to leave. So we have all this stuff. The kids went on the ship. It's the mad dash to get it done so we can get to the, the ship. <laughs> Are we gonna be those guys that no! are running toward the cruise ship at the last minute? We I'm gonna look how far away it's like a, it's like two miles away over there. Are we gonna be those guys that are running at the last minute? It looks like we made the shuttle in time. You think we're gonna make it? I think we're just growing good, baby. <laughs> it always works out. Success. We made it. We did the checkpoint. We're good. We're on the ship. So our kids will not be going home parents. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a responsible thing to do. Make sure you get on the ship in time. We got about 15 minutes left to go, so we're definitely mom, good. You know, my mom always told me I'm always late to everything. But I go, you know what, mom? I'm going to prove you wrong. I will not be late to a cruise because it will leave you. <laughs> Merry, Merry Christmas, Christmas from, from Castaway Key. Key. Now back onto the boat because we got 10 minutes. Look spare. at that Christmas tree behind us. That, that looks is pretty beautiful. cool. Beautiful. We made it. We made it. We're back on the ship. We heard some noises out on the balcony, and when we went out to look, we saw everyone from the island was waving goodbye and saying thank you. There are so many little touches that make this already amazing experience extraordinary. What's going on? All right, we're ready for the pirate show. All right, next, let's see that pirate outfit. Wow, that it looks like Jack Sparrow. All right, we got our swords in full effect. We're waiting on the show to start. And now we're all pirated out. Are you wearing eyeliner? Uh, I'm wearing some guy liner today and I'm feeling pretty good about it. It was so cool to see everyone on the ship go all out for pirate night. The performances were out of this world and we even got a surprise appearance from Captain Hook. So there's a lot of excitement going on. Out, the fireworks are gonna go off really, really soon. But we know that our kids are a part of a flash mob. Go, 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 a We're still so impressed that these kids learned all these dances from the amazing kids club. Sandy, how cool is that? I'm a proud mama. 
No pirate party would be complete without turning the deck into a 300 person conga line. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. All right, we got a uh, pizza ready to go because we are starving. And one of the coolest things about the cruise ship is you can just grab some pizza and go. All right, so we are heading to the gym because we need to get a workout in. We've been indulging in lots of food, lots of desserts, and a few beverages. All right, workout complete. Yes. Nice job. Let's go get All some right, beef. Let's go. We also found out that if you run two and a half laps around the ship, it equals one mile. Nothing says breakfast of champions like some Mickey Mouse churro Can you waffles. See what this is? Mickey churro waffles. Day four was a sea day, which meant we got to eat, drink, eat some more, and drink a little more. Then we set off on an adventure to find some more Donald Disney characters. Donald Duck is definitely trying something new! We headed back to the room to get freshened up before heading down to the Disney Theater to watch an epic production of Beauty and the Beast. Epic. We headed down to our final restaurant of the cruise, where we again had an amazing waitstaff, unlimited food, wonderful drinks, and got to connect as a family. Oh yeah, and don't forget delicious desserts. I think we ordered one of everything. The fun just doesn't stop coming. Just as we walked out of the restaurant, we walked right into a full-blown holiday party with all of our favorite characters. Well, that wraps an amazing four nights, five days here on the Disney Dream. I don't know. I don't know who had more fun, us or the kids. <laughs> don't want I, don't I don't want to go back to reality. To <laughs> I don't know. Awesome. Merry I Christmas. guess we'll have to Happy come on another cruise. Time to leave. How are you feeling? Sad. Sad? Aww. How are you feeling? I'm excited to see you. How are you feeling about the trip? Oh, it was super fun. You know, I don't want it to end. That is this was a uh, really so easy. Everything was amazing. We the had the best time. Oh, I'm so sad, but I'm also super excited to see Roxy. I miss all my counselors already. <laughs> All right, we're back to reality. I don't know if I like the way it feels to be back on land, away from the uh, epicness that we uh, just experienced. Guys, we had a great time. We can't wait to go do this again. And we definitely tried something new! Woo, oh, we sure did, it We don't want it to end. Whatever you do, get out there and try something new. Oh, uh, that was pretty good, good guy. Good. Do you want try it to end? No. But I want it I want to get our own thing. We want to get our, our own, own boat. ship so go. we can sail wherever we want and Roxy can come with Love us. It. And grandma and grandpa. 